Welcome back to Chinstrap Chaps. I found a hammer. Oh. Time. I'll wait a bit to text him because we, we just started. Fabio's gonna be like, Taylor, Taylor, what the fuck, Taylor, Taylor? Please come. I need you to work at the post office. <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> What's Fabio? Welcome back to Chinstrap Chaps. This episode is sponsored by Wild Cherry Pepsi. Wild Cherry Pepsi. Get your face in my ace. I'm my not, face and your ass. I mean, your face and your, my your ass. Your ass and my face. What's up? I forgot I killed this bitch. Why? I mean, with the, with a sponsorship like that, why are, why aren't we sponsored? You know? Oh, Montana. What is it? What's the capital? Uh, you should know this Topeka. No, that's Kansas. <laughs> um. <laughs> Montana, Montana, Hamilton, no. Starts with an H. Oh it does start with an H. Like, is um, Hamilton a, I don't, is Hamilton a I don't think it's. I don't think it is. I, I haven't, I haven't <laughs> studied my, uh, my state capitals in a little bit, so I gotta remember it a little bit too. Um, Starts Houston, no. No, no. That's Texas. Yeah, that's Texas. Uh. And that's not even the capital of Texas. <laughs> uh, what, yeah. You know, I just looked these up for the for the purpose of. <laughs> Did you? Know yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, Harriet. No. No. God, what was it? You're probably thinking of Harrisburg. Which yeah. Is the capital yeah, Harrisburg, of Pennsylvania. Or are you gonna look it up? Yeah. You I mean, I just literally had it. What oh, was it? You stupid bitch. What's the H one? There's Honolulu. Hartford. Nope. No. That's Connecticut. That's right. Yeah. And there's a couple of those I still get mixed up. Concord, Frankfurt, and Hartford. This doesn't even have all of them. What kind of list is this? No wonder why I didn't see it. Um, Abby's just idling. It's like, <laughs> shit, what is the capital of Montana? <laughs> this is really important. Uh, my arm is hurting. Shut up, shut up. I'm doing something. Montana. Um, Montana. That's an M. Alright, this is the only one you're looking up. Yep. Helena. That's yes. right. Yes. Helena. That correct. That's stupid. It's a stupid name. I know, but that that's what it is. I'm sorry. I don't like it. <laughs> I didn't like fucking it. name that you one. You should change it. I would have named it Petition. Honey Goat Weed instead, but, <laughs> you know. Petition. If I named a cap, I mean, like, what? You're going to give me the, like, you know, the abilities of, like, No Man's Sky where I can fucking label shit and it's like, hammer yep. fuck face. Yep. Yeah. Yep. You can name it whatever you want, Taylor. What do you want to name Horny it? Horny Goat Weed. Horny Goat <laughs> I'm going to name it Hell, Michigan, Montana. Oh. So it's going to be all of it. Give it. Give me the skizzers. I'm going to name it. <laughs> <laughs> well, just, just the word beat. No, like that. You have to play the sound every time. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna name, uh, like, I don't know. I don't know what would be an appropriate state. Uh, Ohio. I'm gonna name Ohio's capital Jerry, 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 <laughs> Jerry, Ohio. But they already have a Gary. Yeah, but I think no. I think they have Gary. But like, no, it's Jerry exclamation point. Jerry exclamation point. Oh, Jerry okay. Exclamation point. It's like four or five of them, you know. Okay, so I've gone all around now. Oh. <laughs> and, then, and then they're like, is Jerry Springer, like, is he associated with the, the town? And then Jerry oh, no. Springer's just like, I've never even heard of that fucking place. What? <laughs> uh, I didn't get this place. Gimme. Gimme. I'm to raiding all your friends and family that you used to know. I'm taking all their shit, girl. <clears throat> all your family that you used to know. Yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hold on. <laughs> The musician on his goatee that you used to know. <laughs> I think he took a hiatus on music for a while. Yeah, he, well, I think, yeah, he hasn't released anything under that name, I think, you know, since that album. Yeah, I think he's he has released something, but just not under his name. As far as I know, like, he's, like, such a down-to-earth dude, too, like, um... Because that song, obviously, like, kind of made his career worldwide. Yeah. And, like, I'm pretty sure afterwards, like... He didn't really give a shit about it. Like, he didn't care. <laughs> like, like oh, he was, like, you know, world famous, and he's just like, yeah, whatever. 
You yeah. know, that's the kind of thing I want to be. I want to be world famous and just not give a fuck. Yeah. Well, and that's and that's cool though because I think he, want, like, allowed people to make covers and shit, and like people were offering him a lot of money for the song, and he's like, whatever, just do whatever. Like, I don't care. It's a music. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Oh, you got the two-handed axe. Oh. That guy had a lot of time to react, and he just did not. <laughs> he's do just like, what do I do? <laughs> this is it. it. It turns out he's one of those people that always like freezes when uh, when anything is happening, <laughs> and he's like, "Oh, no one will ever like. I'll just let the first person go, and nothing will happen, and we'll be fine." She's always got this. Oh no, what's happening? I don't. I don't <laughs> know. What to he never prepared for the actual scenario. <laughs> he he always mentally prepares. But the uh, the ending is always that uh, the person he's with is the one who stops everything oh. before. <laughs> so he, he doesn't actually know what to do once he gets into that situation. Oh, I see. Ugh. Benjamin Gates. Oh, God, I'm gonna... Peter. <laughs> Benjamin Gates, he's the guy from uh, National Treasure. <laughs> Somebody did an anonymous one, you see that? Yeah. Fucking all is well. Sarah fights him, boo. I think it's interesting because it's, you know, kind of a parallel to, like, the beginning of the game when um, Ellie and Dina were doing that. Yeah, going through, you know, all that, <laughs> okay, all their wolf stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah, like, they had the patrols in Jackson or whatever. Yeah, that too. I, pretty much every single group has them. The yeah. wolves have them, yeah. Jackson has them, you know... The scars have them. Oh, the seraphim. Fuck you. I'll call you whatever I fucking want. You got. Wow. <laughs> Abby's really living up to her bitch nature. Well, she is a bitch. Um, I was thinking about it the other day, and uh, I don't know how you're feeling with it, but like. Even after I've beaten the game, like, I still don't really like a Abby. <laughs> yeah, no, no, I still don't like her. I don't really, like, I don't really, I don't know, she, she like, when, when Mel called her a piece of shit, I'm like, yeah, yeah, you're kind of yeah, right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, Mel, I don't really like you either, but, like, you know, I just, I just don't like Abby. Yeah. Uh, I don't think the game... Necessarily wants you to like her, but I think I think I don't know. Like I, I, do I know it's trying. Kinda... They're trying to make it into like a gray area. Mm -hmm. But like, at no point in time am I like, yeah, you know, I totally get it. I'm just like, no, fuck this bitch. I get it. I just I'm not on her side of things anyway. <laughs> I was the same way. Like you know, when I first played this game, I'm like fuck Abby. <laughs> like she's a cool character and everything, but she's not like she's. I don't know. She's a bitch. I don't really like her either. Yeah. Like, I don't really like her personality. I don't like her braid. Her braid is the worst fucking part about her. Yeah. Fucking take it off, bitch. She can be, you know, she can be the strong strong lady. I don't care about that. Just, like, I wish she didn't have a braid. I think it looks dumb. <laughs> like, give her, like, a ponytail instead. Like, that'd be better. Oh, God. What, what is your opinion of braids, Billy? Uh, they look good on certain people. Hmm. Or would you put it on your tier list of hairstyles? <laughs> on hairstyles? <laughs> Dep it depends on the woman. That's the thing. Oh. Like, some women pull it off much better than others. And then it can be like an, <sighs> like an A tier. I'm sorry. If it's on the wrong woman, then, it, you know, it, it's like a D tier or an F tier. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And bring some dessert or something. It's probably brownies. All right, sponsored um, by Reese's. Ah. I'm gonna get a scop. The scopes are good. The scopes are pretty good, actually. Yeah. Four times scope. I told you I got a gun now, right? Yeah. Yeah. 
My dad's sending me up some ammo now too. Great. <laughs> I'm like, he's like, oh, I got some uh, some range ammo, and then I got some self defense hollow point ammo oh my that God. I'm sending for you. I'm like, Duh, okay. I don't think you need the hollow point. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I shot hollow point. They're um, they got some kickback, like all because they got like more powder and they, shit in them. I feel so like you like, using hollow point would go against your nature because hollow points are what killed John Lennon. Yeah. Well, I mean, John Lennon deserved it. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I read the other day? There was like an article that popped up from whatever fucking site, I don't know. Well, there was one that popped up that said like, um, the, these artists hated their songs or whatever, you know, because, you know, sometimes people like will, they'll release a song that and gets like super popular it gets and they too hate popular, it. You know, yeah. like, you know, Kurt Cobain is very vocal about that with uh, Teen Spirit and whatever, you know. Yeah. Um, I read one, and I, I don't know about, I, I've never heard this before, but John Lennon apparently hated everything that he did with the Beatles. Yeah. <laughs> and like He even, felt it was too childish to, uh, like, you know, like the by the numbers, because he wanted to be um, revolutionary. He wanted, right. you know. But I think, he, I think he said that, too, about, like, some of his own solo shit, too. Yeah. He, he was a man of, uh, he always hated everything he did, basically. Yeah. It's interesting. But he's probably the one who came up with, like, Revolution Number 9. He did. Yeah. So, shut up. <laughs> Makes me wonder, then, if there's any song that he's created or had his hand in that he was actually, like... Yeah, I like that one. Yeah, I like that one. You probably liked uh, Woman is the uh, of the Universe. Just because Yoko had a lot of... Is it of the one. universe or of the world? Yeah, of the world. <laughs> <laughs> I like to say of the universe. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just to like get that more deep. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever heard that song. I think I've heard parts of it. Uh, it's actually pretty decent. Does like, say, it's real does jazzy. He, does he say the title in the song? Oh, yeah. It's the first, first words. Oh, okay. He goes, Woman is the... Of the world, yes, she is. If you think about it, woman is the of the world. I'm glad you're you're censoring yourself because normally you wouldn't. <laughs> yeah, I you'd know. make you'd make that my job to do. <laughs> I'm trying to you know trying to give you less editing. Oh, you know, know. being a nice man. Also, I'm trying to say say the N word less in my life. That's not a bad thing. I encourage yeah. that. I also am trying to say less swear words less in my life too. Yeah. I'm trying to you know not PC myself, but like just tone it down. Yeah, tone it down. Like I'm not so radical anymore. Yeah, I notice. I notice. I swear quite a bit, but I know when to when to dial it back. You know. Yeah. The way the way I see it, like especially at work and stuff. Because I want to look professional, be yeah. professional. Because mm -hmm. I mean, I'm, I'm in a position of power now, so I'm Ooh. trying to tone it back. See, that's why when I did my my uh, TV audio videos, I censored myself because I'm like, you know what? Now that's suitable for all audiences, right there. Okay. Because so. then Melissa's nephew watched it, and it's like, yeah, now he can watch it because there's bleeps in it. Yeah. You know. In certain circumstances, it's I, I get it. In other circumstances, it's like no, like I don't I don't like I I don't think um, censorship in music is good. No, I don't think that's a good thing. But I can understand. I, I think censorship in general is not a very good thing. Yeah. Unless it's willingly, like at work and stuff like that. That's yeah. a little bit. Well, better. that's what I mean. Like if you're trying to maintain a professional image, like I think that that is good. Like like in your case and in my case with my you know. Um, TV audio videos like I think that those are both good applications of it Yeah. but I think like in the sense of like you know having like a radio edit for a song or something like I'm not really you know a big advocate for that like I understand the reasoning for it but at the same time if there's a really vulgar song then just don't play it on the radio like it's that simple Yeah. like that new Cardi B song WAP wet Ass pussy. Yes. 
I only heard that song like the first time like last week. I have <laughs> never heard it. It's not good. Yeah, I don't like Cardi B, so I don't either. I think she sucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so at no point in time where I'm like, I want to lose this. No, but that record. but that Canadian guy that I like that does like the music uh, analysis things, like where he you know makes fun of them and shit. Like he did a video on it, and I'm like, oh, I like his videos because he talks about bad music. <laughs> And yes, that song is bad. Yo, cause I got these dogs over the fucking ass, my boy, ass pussy, right? Is that how it sounds. It's probably. It sounds about like that. Yeah. What am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to murder everyone here? <clears throat> I mean, you can if you <clears throat> want to. But do I have to? I'd be the worst at stuff. <laughs> 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 like, like, Francis was at you. Who stole my Mountain Dew? <laughs> Those sons of a bitch! <laughs> Let me smell your breath. May she shield us from our ignorance. There's a lot of people here. It's very hard to sneak through this area because there are so many people. I'm gonna master this stealth. You watch. I probably could have okay. gotten through this without killing, but like you know, it's possible. But you have to be very patient, and like you might have to distract a guard or two. You know. Yeah. Um. Yeah, it is possible though. I've I think I did it one time on one of my previous playthroughs. Some of these people, like that guy over there. Like, he just does not move. Like, he pretty much stays oriented in that area and, like, kind of facing the same direction the whole time. So, he's one of those ones that you might either have to subdue or um, distract somehow. Yeah. See, he's, like, just kind of, like, going right back and forth in a line. I always thought it was funny too, like in hindsight, when you um, find out that the scars are kind of like a more simple folk. Like, I think you might be turning around. When they find out that they're like a simple folk type of people, they're trying to go back to like, you know, the living off of, you know, the, the land, like returning to earth, you know, type of deal. Yeah. Um, they, that they, they make an exception to still use guns though. Yeah. <laughs> Well, you know, you gotta, you gotta move with the time. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> All right, oh, maybe. Yeah, gun, yeah. Yeah. Oh, ah, bitch. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? I don't give a shit up. Oh. Seraphite Emily. You gotta get that air out, boy. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Dang it. Oh. oh my god, see there's so many dude. Oh ah. my god, no, no, ah. okay. <laughs> He just got swarmed. Yeah, you know what, fuck sneaking past all these bitches. I'm just gonna murder them. All. Oh, you're back here, you can try it again. Oh, okay. It's funny because like I was saying to you earlier, I just did the, I platinumed all the Jack games. Jack 2 has some of the worst checkpoints in any game. <laughs> yeah. Because you'd be at the end of a mission and then you would die and then you'd just start the whole fucking thing all over again. Come on, quick! Just fucking run! Run here! Run here! Run here! You're up? Are you running? You didn't run. I think it's mainly that one dude. Yeah. Like, because he just keeps going back and forth. Oh my god, where did they go? Oh, I think you can leave. I just you gotta go where we are is, I think, yeah. Alright. At first when I went when I was going through this part of the game, I was trying to be non lethal, like quote unquote non lethal, because 
Like, these are technically her people still. Yeah, but she's like, fuck them. But at the same time, like, they're hunting her because, like, they're the yeah. apostate or whatever. But, like, I don't know. I'm like, I tried, Yara, forgive me. Even though I've killed my own friends to fucking save you. <laughs> it's just, personally, I don't like the wolves. I was part of them for a long time, but, you know, fuck them. The wolves are kind of dicks. Yeah. I mean, everybody in this game is a dick, pretty yeah, much. Yeah, like, in their own way, they're all dicks. Yeah, everyone's an asshole and a dick. Everyone's an asshole and a dick. Did you should like my song? Yeah, I think uh, I don't think we should put some strings in it. You always want to put strings in it. Maybe a little bit of a synth bass. It's always the synth bass. Did you see that? Did you see that one video of the guy playing watermelon? No. There must be some kind of like connector thing that he makes, or like that exists that it, like can trigger like a MIDI notes or something by like completing a circuit or whatever. So he put them, he attached them all to watermelons, and then like <laughs> I'll just show you. It's pretty great. Hey, we're gonna have to turn my head apart. But oh yeah, welcome back. We got Mother Caramel Flan by Senor Gusto. Gotta say, not a fan. You killed your mom, you bitch! Yeah, because her mom was trying to kill Lev. I'm done eating this. Did you finish it? No. It's just, I don't like the texture. I don't want to eat it anymore. Ugh. Yeah, it's a weird one. I'm sure some people like it. I don't. I don't really like it either. <laughs> She's pretty decent. The rice pudding that they make is alright. She's a little old, but you know, Asian people. Uh, She's dead. They uh they they keep their they keep their luster after. Yeah, they they age pretty gracefully actually. And then they age terribly. Yeah, they age gracefully up to a point, and then they just, <laughs> it just hits them like a fucking shit brick house. <laughs> yeah. But then they stay that way. Mm -hmm. Like it doesn't change after that. Also, like it just stays that way. I don't know. But, yeah. I'm gonna have to tack on like three minutes of this one. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be Vancouver Island, I think. I think. I mean, it's by the Space Needle. Yeah. I think, I mean, like I said, I think it's supposed to be, but maybe not. I mean, Vancouver Island is over there. Like, that way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pillage your guys' stuff real quick. Hold on. Okay. I mean, it's not like they're going to use it. Oh, sweet. Scented candles. Awesome. I fucking love candles. Some bongos. Sweet. Oh, you guys want to have a powwow? <laughs> you know, I hated people that would be like, hey, we're going to have a powwow. No! That's cultural appropriation. Mm -hmm. can't, can't say that shit. Hey, do, do improve silencers, and then you can craft a silencer. Or not. I gotta get that that tree going. Do you have to though? Yeah, I do. I'm just tired. I'm just tired. 
Because faith isn't real. Faith is just a way to make you not feel like a butt. Yeah. Yeah, kind of, yeah. You know, give a meaning to this, uh... Meaning that's existing? Yeah. <laughs> and some people need it. Some people use it like a crutch. And some people don't. So, you know, like... Just don't force your crutch on other people. That's the that's the big thing. Yeah. Like, just because you're limp doesn't mean that you had to beat me with your your crutches until I'm limp. Yep, I agree. I want to be if if I'm gonna be limp, I want it to be my own decision. You know. Yeah. And if I'm hard, then I want to be hard because of my own decision also. Yeah. Sometimes I can't help being hard, so yeah, get away from me. <laughs> Sometimes I'm limp and hard at the same time. I'm thinking about certain things, okay? It makes me go hard. And vice versa. Sometimes I think about other things and I go limp. Fuck yeah. off. Sometimes I'm limpy hard. M mind your own business. You know, that's life. Get away from me. <laughs> Stop touching me. What are you doing? Get away. You're making me hard. <laughs> oh no, I'm limp again. Get back over here. What's even know. happening in this scenario? I don't even understand. Is the person like telling someone this? <laughs> Is he like getting assaulted? Is What's happening? Schizophrenia? I don't know. Something's happening. <laughs> Something is happening. That's all that can be confirmed. <laughs> Something's happening. And he's he's getting limp and hard, which is most likely his penis. <laughs> oh, it's a guy going back and forth on his diet. <laughs> I'm going hard on my diet. Oh no, I got limp. Go. <sighs> Any more snacks? Nope. Oh, itchy eyeball. Who's, who's pooping for this long? We gotta hear that, that, that water. Well, right now it's not too bad. Um, we're getting to the point in the year where the sprinklers probably aren't gonna be running much more. Nice. I think it's, I don't know, somebody running a sink or something. Oh, oh, or potentially oh, like the, the washing machine maybe. A washing machine? I don't know. Just keep going. <gasps> Lightning. Lightning <laughs> scares me, Taylor. <laughs> well, I think next time on Chin Strap Chaps, we'll pick this up. And I'll go through this door! Alright, well. Look at that. Uh -huh.